coming up on around town. Got a lot of honeycomb, got some ladders, got a lot of bees for another honeybee extraction. I'm Matt, and this is Around Town with Town & Country Pest Solutions. Well, we're out today on a construction site of sorts. Joining Manny, what brings us out here today? So up there we have some honeybees. You can see them flying around, coming in and out of the soffits right where it meets the chimney. What sort of things did we bring to the site to make sure we're pretty well equipped to handle this? So as you can see Jay up there, he's in his bee suit. So we got all kinds of tools to take the soffits out. We'll have the bee boxes and things like that. We'll remove the hive and then we'll, we'll relocate it from here. Awesome. All right, man. Well, let's get to work. Thanks. Let's do it. With major renovations underway at this west side house, the team at Tactical Construction had to put a halt on further progress once they came across this active hive to ensure the safety of their workforce. That's when they gave us a call. While it's crucial for this extraction to be thorough, it's just as important for this job to be swift so that renovations can resume. From my perspective here, Jay's got just a little peek open. We can see some older comb. It's definitely some discolored, kind of brownish. We got bees starting to swarm. They can definitely sense our presence. As Jay has been pulling some more comb out, investigating, oh, there we go, yep. There's just an outpouring of bees now. We can hear the hum. It's a little more active. There you go. Whoa. It didn't take much longer for Jay to strike the mother load. Section after section, this healthy colony had prepared an incredible amount of honey, which was a tasty treat for everyone involved. When sealed in an airtight container, honey is one of the few foods known to have an eternal shelf life. That's because honey is naturally acidic and low in moisture, making it inhospitable for bacteria. This also made honey a common medical treatment in ancient times, helping protect cuts and burns from bacterial infections. I have a beautiful hunk of honeycomb just loaded. I bet this is gonna taste real good. Mmm. The honeycomb wax, very chewable. It's just loaded. Look at that, unreal. Some of the best honey I've ever had in my life, and it came out of that house. Take another bite. With a fair amount of comb loaded into the frames, we still needed to locate the queen. Using our thermal camera, Jay discovered that these bees have expanded further up than we originally thought. Thankfully, with this house going through a total renovation, there were no issues with us cutting open the wall inside to continue our search for the queen. So we've cut a little bit more open in the wall. Manny was outside pushing some smoke into the hole, try to drive them up. We're still on the lookout for our queen, but right now we're just trying to scoop as many of these bees into our box. Jay is downstairs. Now check this out. We, we already extracted a bunch of comb and honey. We found the queen, guys. We found, all right, let's check it out. Let's check it out. Where are you, Jay? Just you... at her, in here. I'm just looking at her. There she is. Center on my spot. Love that. Jay found the queen. We're gonna get her into the box with all the rest of the bees, clean up everything so we can head out. Well, that just about wraps it up for us. Another pretty sweet adventure in the books. Anyway, I'm Matt Miller. We'll catch you at the next job. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe to get all of our content into your feed from Town & Country Pest Solutions.